But, uh, okay, this is top 24 now. Okay, now this makes sense. I was going to say, like, how are these two playing in pools, okay? Like, this is going to be interesting. I haven't seen Terry Dinners on Pichu, but the thing is, like, playing the character like Bowser Jr., like, for so long, it just seems like it just makes sense for him to pick a better character and do well. So he's not, like, held back by these characters, like, irritating him. Right? I feel, like, I feel like you just get so good at this game, like fundamentally, that you just kind of pick up anybody, and there's right. only like a small curve. Like I feel like Daisy's a bit of a curve, even for players like Zero, who's just like, oh, I gotta learn how to float cancel. Nobody has that. Yeah. This is scary though, because Peach is so light, and Daisy hits like a truck pretty much. Like the next big hit should like definitely kill Tay right here. Oh yeah, big time, big time. I mean, both hit like trucks. Yeah. Oh my goodness, he went so deep for that side beat. Yeah. That would have super killed him. I think I heard Razo on Twitter say that um, Peach Bomb is the best projectile in the game. <laughs> and I totally agree. I, the way that I've seen Razo use uh, Peach Bomb. Turned himself into a projectile, baby. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that was a snare lock. Wow. So much death. Oh my god, he's 84. God. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's so dead. And you know, I think they kind of nerfed uh, Peach's forward air just a little bit, but it's still really deadly. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> Instead of floating back, he just does another side B, because hey, why not? It looks like you fly back farther too when you bounce off the shield than, than before. So it looks like even safer than usual. It, it's basically safe. Uh, I think it can still be punished, but it's it's very hard to. Oh, Forward Tilt's going to take that out. I think after it hits your shield, it's, I don't know, there's not much anything you can do. It's, it's, like, it's kind of like, like spot dodging, they have the landing lag of the move. Definitely. It's kind of like a Squirtle's withdrawal, yeah. where it's fairly safe or like hard to punish, but I feel like there's a way around it. Okay. Oh. Taylor's Pikachu trying to do the... Oh, whiffing that grab, but hey, you know, blocking that, a little block punish for you. Oh, wow, I'm surprised that forward air didn't do much. It just completely win. Whiffing again? Wow, the range is not what I thought it was. Taylor, man, he's trying to make these combos happen. He's like running head first through these hitboxes, but it's just... It's not working out, man. Okay. Mm. I don't know. It's just it's so risky to play a character like Pichu versus like such a heavy hitter like Daisy. Oh yeah, definitely. Especially when you're hurting yourself the whole time. I mean, I mean, Pichus are already like well aware of that, but it, it does come into play. Oh, good nair though. Good nair. Doing a good job in this stock to mm -hmm. avoid just getting blown up by straight hits. I agree. Most of the damage that Pichu oh. has done himself. Oh, oh, okay, okay. He didn't land on top of Raza. That was a smart idea. Good oh. grab. You didn't know you were at 48. I would never want to be above this character. Like, up air, up smash. Oh God, up smash. <laughs> Terrifying. Oh, and that was a dot just thrown away. Yeah, there's like 20 plus percent up here. Uh, close to 20. Like, maybe like 17. Good forward to wow, oh. that took it out. Had just enough rage. That toe is so ridiculous. <laughs> it doesn't look like a kill move, but it is. It's now the most frightening hit. So hitbox. fast, too. <gasps> oh, we, we're. Oh. oh. And you know what really sucks? PS2 has that big pole in the middle, so you can't even go underneath the stage. Right. You're just, you're confined. But, uh, yeah, uh, I had no idea Tatonator even had a Pichu. Yeah, I just know he's trying to find another character other than Bowser Jr. Like, I think at this point, like he's played uh, Bowser Jr. for like, I think, like all Smash 4. He wants to see how far he can go with like a much like better character, like, like a top to it, you know, mm. from the start. Instead of just like, I'm just gonna limit myself to playing only this character because like I'm that comfortable with like this character. You know what I mean? I mean, I can't, I can't hate that choice. I really can't. Um, I mean, I think Bowser Jr. is pretty, pretty cool. But if you're trying to like go to tournaments and like make money that way pick up the Cena I don't know yeah yeah I can see it and, you know but there's so many sleepers out there like Wario like tweak like hello you know um, this, I don't this, know. this game it's is just, just untapped yeah and it's uh that's another reason why you should play other characters too it's like there's 70 plus why would you only play Bowser Jr <laughs> yeah of all characters All right, so we're going into game two. Browser taking that final stock by SD, so let's hope that doesn't happen again. The Taternator still sticking with the P2, running right to a toe, 26%? Hello? Yeah. Oh my god. People do so much damage in this game, it's crazy. Oh yeah. I except she. <laughs> except she. Except she, for sure. 
catching the, the little radish too. Oh. Turnip. Oh boy. Okay, making you it back. To, you to get the double there. <laughs> a little double kick. That would have been really cool if you got that. I just need to get that in order to get that early stock. Oh yeah. I mean, uh, Pichu is a really heavy hitter though. Okay, ooh, that was kind of a strange landing from Taternator. He definitely didn't want to be there, but he's still making something work in the here. Yeah, I thought he was going to try to get, like, the Thunder Spike off stage. Just because, I don't know, that's one of the things you can go for if you're not going to go for the Air Spike as Pichu. Oh, my goodness. Does Peach have any good out-of-shield options besides up B? Or is that is that even a good out-of-shield like option? Anything full cancel to get out-of-shield. <laughs> Maybe Nair, yeah. I'll have to ask Raza, like, oh, what his favorite. Or yeah, I felt so pretty sweet. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> just kick him out of there. So light. Mm. I like how Razo's just playing the RNG games. Like, I'm just going to pick turnips until I get something good. And there's, like, a very high chance of getting something good in this game. Oh, yeah, you're either going to get a Saturn, which is from the Mother Universe. If those of you don't know, the Mr. Saturn's from Mother. So I don't know why Peach is picking that up. Uh, hey, whatever. Crossover oh, game. So random item that Peach needs to pick up. That was zany enough for Zachary to add to a new set. Mm. And people actually use that yeah. in this game. They really go for that Saturn. They try to keep that on save. Shield break for free. Yep, definite. If your opponent's not paying attention, it's, it's, it's shield break can add zero percent. Oh yeah, that's one of the reasons I like watching Peach so much. And she's just a good character. Yeah, it's crazy that like Peach main got rewarded so well from like being able to just grind a little dollars into Peach. Mm. in the last game, and now you get super payoff for it in this she, game. She wasn't even bad. I don't think she's really been bad in any game. I don't know about Brawl, but I mean, she's just always been a really solid character. Just very high technical barrier. That was yeah. about it. Very footsies oriented, which is kind of... Like, I'm really big on characters like that as well. Uh, but right now, uh, you know, Tater needs to give him the footsies right now. Yeah, this is really rough for Tater, honestly. Razo just looks so comfortable. Like, he doesn't really look like... He's threatened by the Pichu at all. Yeah. And his spacing is really on point, too. It's like his accuracy with his attacks. Like, Pichu is not an easy target to hit. No, which is really says how good. Uh, oh, uh, another SD. Uh, that was the thing I didn't want to see. Uh, <laughs> oh, well. Someone jumping around in the back after that SD. <laughs> I don't know why anybody I, would be happy I think, about I think she's, I think she's a Razo fan. 